four clinics helping New Mexico veterans could possibly be closing down, including this one right here in Las Vegas. But many residents, including a state senator, say not so fast. So what you're going to talk about today is critically important for you and for our country. Growing concerns for veterans in New Mexico. We served our country and this is almost the thanks that we get from the government. No. Some VA clinics throughout the state may be closing based on a recommendation from Washington, D.C. They include locations in Gallup, Española, Raton, and Las Vegas, rural communities which hold limited opportunities for veterans like Christopher Archuleta. This closure would be very bad for myself because then I would have to travel all the way to Albuquerque or go back to the Tallahassee Buck where I transferred from in the first place because of issues that I was having out there. The proposal not pleasing many state leaders from the head of Veterans Services. We were all shocked and awed about this and we started uh, reacting. To Senator Ben Ray Lujan. Veterans that live in rural communities like most of New Mexico, this is hard on them. He's now speaking with them from personal interactions to listening sessions to make sure their voices are heard and acknowledged. We're having conversations with veterans in communities um, to make sure we're collecting accurate data. Um, that we're doing everything we can to prevent this from happening. This clinic is just one of 174 locations throughout the country, which could close its doors soon. Reporting in Las Vegas, Brian Albizu, KOAT Action 7 News.